Here is the last example concerning the uniform distribution. Find a random variate generation algorithm for generating a random variate x which has the uniform distribution with parameters a and b. The cumulative distribution function of x, which is uniform a, b, is capital F of x equals x minus a divided by b minus a for x values between a and b. Now I'm being a little bit sloppy here in that if I were being careful I would say capital F of x is 0 for x less than or equal to a. It's x minus a over b minus a for x values between a and b and capital F, F of x is equal to 1 for x values that are greater than or equal to b. But what I've written down here is I've written down the cumulative distribution function on its most interesting portion, which is the portion that corresponds to its support. Now in developing a random variate generation algorithm, it's always of interest to take a look at the geometry behind what is going on. And so here is a picture of the cumulative distribution function of a uniform AB random variate. It is 0 for x values less than A. It is linear between A and B and then it is 1 thereafter and that is the cumulative distribution function. The way you generate a uniform AB random variate is you choose some random number between 0 and 1 and I'll go ahead and choose one maybe about right here that looks like about 0.4 and the geometry is you come across to the cumulative distribution function and go down to the x-axis and that value right there will be a uniform AB random variate. The mathematics behind putting together the random variate generation algorithm is you set the cumulative distribution function equal to u and you solve this equation for x and when you solve this for x you need to multiply of course by b minus a and then add a and you will get this equation right here as what is known as the inverse cumulative distribution function of a random variable which is uniformly distributed between a and b. So once you have that which is defined for u values between 0 and 1 a one line random variate generation algorithm is x is equal to and you simply put in this inverse cumulative distribution function where u is some random number and when you see that u is a random number you can think of that random number as a uniform 0 1 they mean the same thing random number and uniform 0 1 are the same so basically what happens here is this b minus a will involve either a stretching if b minus a is greater than 1 or it will denote a shrinking if b minus a is less than 1 and this a will denote a shifting. So again what happens is you start out with something that's uniformly distributed between 0 and 1 you stretch it or shrink it to where it will now fit in an interval of this length and then finally you add a to move that out from the origin and that will give you a random variant that has the uniform distribution between a and b.